I'm in the UK in our warehouse. It's not raining, but I tell you what, it is absolutely windy. The power hub, look at this, I'm with Lee, our tech lead, and you've got it all powered and up and running, 120 kilo. We have stock in the UK, and okay, I open the door, it's rather noisy. Uh, I'll close it over, it's a bit, as Lee said, it holds the noise, it's dead quiet. You, know, you go around here into the inverter room, and the thing is absolutely rocking and rolling. These are the power, the power switches here. Um, Lee, come and explain what each of the items are. So, oh, sorry. on the side here, we've got the auxiliary panel. The auxiliary panel is basically controlling the HVAC, the fire suppression system, uh, as well as the light signals to the outside, where you've got the power run and alarm. Uh, and this is just making sure it's all controlled, humidity, temperature, uh, and in the case of any. And down here? So this is your temperature and humidifier control uh, showing the values of the internals so everything is here and it, it, the connections are external oh. okay it's here this is our connections so connection cupboard so grid load and generator or auxiliary yes so this thing is it's amazing it's fully ip65 yes they're in stock in south africa they're in stock in the uk and you know it mightn't be the prettiest thing in the world, but I tell you what, it's solid, it's great, it's great for all sorts of applications, it's secure, and you know, it's all about reliability. You want something that's gonna be reliable, and our tech is years old, and it is reliable, and that's the most important thing. And serviceability, serviceability. This is a low density unit, um, and it doesn't use, we don't use liquid cooling, uh, water cooling, as I always tell in the videos, water cooling and, you know, sort of um, high voltages. It's not for, you know, you're an electrical engineer and you're, you're putting high voltage with water, it's not clever. No, not at all. You know, so this is all air cooled and the temperature, the, the, the HVAC, it operates, in, it's quite cool in, the, in, the, in our warehouse in the UK. Um, and I think sort of um, below it, 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 the HVAC cuts in, um, basically it heats the battery. So if the batteries drop right to close to zero, it will heat the batteries up to about 10 degrees. It's like a hysteresis. And if the temperature goes higher, to what temperature? If the temperature goes above 30 degrees. It will cool it. it, it will cool it. So it keeps the batteries in, in, a, in, a, in a, a same, a median, median temperature. Uh, which is absolutely perfect, but this is great for the UK. It's great for anywhere, you know, holiday, yeah. holiday parks, um, businesses, um, garage dealerships, you know, where you've got car charges and you need that extra power. And it's, it's waterproof, it's fully waterproof. It, look, look, this is, yeah, this is, well, they used to call these things on the streets, streets, street, um, there's a name for it, I always used to hear, they used to call things um, street furniture, street furniture. But look, it looks the business. Yeah. And it's, you know, it's, it's running, it's power, no alarm condition, everything is there. This is the business. And it's expandable. So you can expand this thing up to 10 times. So if you, this isn't enough power for you, 10 times will be one and megawatt. So 10 meg so it gives you a megawatt? Megawatt. This is nice. It is really, really nice. So we, I, I'm gonna do, we just got another video which is linked to this, just showing you how you boot it up. But you know, we're ready to rock and roll. If you want something dead reliable with old tech, you know, and we've got a lot of the technology, we've got tens of thousands of systems out there using the same technology, so it's, it's mature technology. We're not a beta, we're not anything. 120 kilowatt, this initially is a 50, but we can do an 80 kilowatt, um, 80 kilowatt battery um, inverter, 120 kilowatt hour inverter. Uh, batteries, uh, okay, right, 120 kilowatt hour battery, uh, 50 or 80 kilowatt inverter. The standard one we've got in stock at the moment is 50, but we'll have 80s coming soon anyway. So keep following us. This is great. This is absolutely great. Think of all your applications, all the jobs you've got coming, whatever, then think about the SunSync. Absolutely tried and tested. It's brilliant for everywhere around the world. Thanks for following. Thanks, Lee. Cheers.